in storytelling and we actually have the power to to shape the stories that Australians see. It is really interesting to explore whether or not having more equality within those decision makers um, does inevitably change the balance of what we see on our screens. When we share our stories, um, when we're inspired by other stories, that's when we can create change. How can we inspire young women to take on numbers of roles if they can't see them in organisations that they work in, but then more directly if they don't see them represented in our media? I think it's really important that we nurture and mentor the next generation of um, women that work within our industry. One of the best pieces of advice I've ever been given is every time you move up the ladder you have to make sure that you're pulling someone else up behind you as well. I think what makes a good leader is someone who has uh, vision for how they want to achieve what they want to achieve. I think the Natalie Miller Fellowship is an absolutely fantastic um, initiative and I would hope that everyone in the industry will do what they can to support it. It's fantastic to have somebody that we can actually um, hold up as being an aspirational role model for other women in the sector. Australia needs your talent. Uh, we need you to step up, we need you to be brave and to, to the extent that the structure of the industry doesn't work for you now, to work with others to create change. I think it's a fantastic opportunity um, to, to promote the sense of, of leadership and continuation and career building. We have a business that is, I think, you know, open to women working there. We just need to actually ask for what we want and I think the Natalie Miller Foundation is going to help women achieve that. Everybody's journey in this industry is their own and as long as people still hang on to their ambition and their tenacity and their integrity, I think they'll find their way. I think it really gives credence to the fellowship that the issues of women's leadership is very much at the top of so many people's agenda.